it makes a lot of sense. And what I would love to do is just dive a little bit into the technical mm-hmm. side of it for anyone who might be interested in using your APIs. How complicated is this? How much skill do you have to have in coding in other areas? So you would need to be a software engineer. So it's really for people that are can already make their own applications, and then they want to add 3D printing functionality to it. So if you could already build your own apps or whatnot, then it would be for you. Now, we would be willing to work internally with the right project. If we're excited about it, we could do some professional services with someone or with a company, though. Well, but let's say you didn't want to do that. And like us, we're not Mm -hmm. coders. We're designers. We're going to be creating the content that's going to be in the app. But would you be willing, if we had another app developer that was willing to do the work that we were going to pay to do it, would we be allowed to license, use whatever it is, your API, provide it to them to complete the app? I mean, you're making this available, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And it's available now. There's people on our website down in the the footer section, there's a a link for developers and you can just request a developer account, which is free. And yeah, you can start doing integrations there. We actually have 45 third-party apps in development. Now, some of those may have kind of fallen off, but 45 in development now, and it's just third-party Developers that have requested an account, and uh, there is one that's been launched from Fanes. I don't know if you guys know Fanes, P-H-A-N-E-S. It's a WordPress plugin. Are you familiar with I'm them? I'm not, but... We're both shaking our I'm, head going, yeah, that's really helpful to you. We're going to check it out. <laughs> okay, but, so, well, Fanes is, they have a WordPress plugin for people that want to sell 3D models uh, through their site that will accept an STL and then determine pricing for printing, depending on the parameters that the website owner puts in. So Fane's added, you know, using our APIs, the ability then for that person, once they take the order, the pricing is done, the order is taken, they could use AstroPrint to go ahead and just send it directly to their 3D printer with cloud slicing and whatnot. Awesome. Uh, and yeah, and they don't have to download the model and import it in the Cura and, and do all this other stuff. So, 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 they, are, so they're using happening. it for like a logistics purpose on the back end of it, which is amazing. 